What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the History of Goju Ryu. I'm the Goju Ryu philosopher, and today we're going to be covering one of the most influential karateka in the Goju Ryu landscape. For the first time on this series, the subject of today's video is still alive and healthy since Sanchin Kata has conditioned him and kept him in shape. Today, our subject is the founder of the International Okinawa Goju Ryu Karate Do Federation, Higao Nomorio Sensei. Let's get into it. Despite sharing the same family name as Miyagi Sensei's Nahate teacher, Higao Nomorio shares no relation to the Nahate lineage. Higao Nomorio was born in late 1938 and began studying Shorin Ryu with his father at the age of 14, quickly becoming invested in karate. His friend Shimabukuro Tsunetaka recommended him to train at the Garden Dojo with Miyazato Eiichi, who had taken over teaching, and he began training there in 1955, two years after Miyagi-sensei's death. At the time, Miyagi Anichi, who was a student but not a relative of Miyagi Chojun-sensei, was in charge of teaching the younger students in Miyazato's classes, and it's Anichi who Higaona credits as being his first Goju-ryu teacher. Higaona sensei would train with both instructors even after instruction moved to Miyazato's Jundokan in 1957. Eventually, Miyagi Anichi would serve on an American oil tanker, and Higaona would go to Takashoku University in Tokyo. In 1960, Higaona sensei was awarded a third dan rank and began to teach in the Yoyogi Dojo in Tokyo, where he would meet and train many martial artists. By April of 1966, he was awarded a fifth dan, and in 1967 he received a Menkyo Kaiden, a document certifying his mastery of the style. There was a great deal of controversy between Higaona sensei and Miyazato Eiichi, specifically relating to Miyagi Anichi. In the IOGKF's official view, Anichi sensei was a direct student of Miyagi Chojun sensei and was his successor. Miyazato sensei's contributions to teaching both Anichi and Higaona are downplayed. In an interview, Higaona Morio sensei stated, I believed in both and followed both. In 1970, they separated, which was a hard blow to me. I had a very difficult time trying to decide whom I should follow. I decided to continue with Miyagi Anichi-sensei, since he had always taught me. Anichi had only been 17 when he began training with Miyagi Chojun-sensei, and was only 22 when his master passed away. Miyazato considered Anichi to be primarily his student, and was responsible for his promotion to 6th dan. Miyazato also considers himself to be Higaona-sensei's primary teacher, and has spoken out on several occasions about Higaona's promotion of Miyagi Anichi as being his teacher and being Miyagi Chojun's successor. In his last interview, Miyazato speculated that this choice may have been better for business for Higaona sensei, as well as insinuated that Anichi may have only studied with Miyagi Chojun sensei for as little as one year's worth of training. The IOGKF has a blog post, listed in this video's sources, that asserts that Miyagi Anichi learned more of Goju Ryu than even Shinzato Jinan, but the testimony of Miyazato sensei and other contemporary martial artists makes this a matter that is still being debated. However, Higao Nomorio clearly learned and taught Goju Ryu at an incredibly high level, regardless of the controversies and politics surrounding his lineage. Across the 60s and 70s, Higao no sensei began traveling to teach and promote karate in various countries, including the United States and France. Eventually, in 1979, he founded his organization, the International Okinawa Goju Ryu Karate Do Federation, in Poole, England, with the help of several international instructors with whom he had worked closely for a while. At that time, he was ranked at 7th dan, a rank that was awarded by Miyazato-sensei, and he would eventually receive 8th and 9th dan promotions from Higa Yuchoku, a shodin new practitioner who was president of the Okinawan Karate and Kobudo Association. These promotions both came in 1984, and three years later, Higaona-sensei would move to San Marcos, California to establish the new Hombu Dojo of the IOGKF. Higaona Morio-sensei would continue to travel and promote Goju-ryu and the IOGKF across the world. This included demonstrations and trips around the United States, as well as Russia, Germany, and Venezuela. He has received many recognitions for his role in promoting Goju Ryu, including an honorary admiralship in the Texas Navy, and the position of Intangible Cultural Treasure of Okinawa. In 2007, he received the rank of 10th Dan from Miyagi Anichi, making him, at the time of writing this script, one of the few currently surviving karateka to hold that rank. At present, he lives in Okinawa and has stepped down as the chief instructor of the IOGKF despite remaining active with karate, relinquishing the title of head instructor to his student Nakamura Tetsuji-sensei. He and the IOGKF have played an enormous role in spreading Goju Ryu across the world. Thanks for watching this video in the History of Goju Ryu series. If you haven't already, please check out the rest of this series as well as my other content. If you liked this video, please hit the like button and leave a comment letting me know who you'd like to see me cover in this series. If you want to catch the rest of the history of Goju Ryu as it comes out, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification icon so you know when I upload them. Additionally, if anyone in the comments can recommend me some good karate books, I would enjoy that. 
I've been the Goju Ryu Philosopher, and keep practicing your Kotei Kitai.